Injured on a knee injury, Jared Lubis. He drops back in the pocket. He looks, the snap. He looks left, nobody there. He's gonna run out, he's gonna roll out to the right. Deep throw down the field. He's gonna have Tyreek wide open. That's a catch. Damn, right. All right, my name is Ian Maluski. I'm a sophomore here at Franklin Pierce University and I am a college sports broadcaster for all sports here. And after college, I hope to get into some form of broadcasting or sports writing. Well, um, I love sports my whole life, so I figured why not go with something I wanted to do. What I do here at school is I um, help out with uh, Raven Sports Network. I help out with the NE10 live streaming, and I've also worked with athletics, filming games, and making uh, condensed highlight reels that will be posted on social media and YouTube. Uh, making sure you get uh, information on any game you're doing. It starts with doing prep, like an hour, hour and a half is a good amount of prep to do for any game that you do. Not just... Um, our team but the opposing team as well just because most of the time I do a uh, color commentary and that's just providing analysis uh, for the game while you have your play-by-play -play guys so you do prep we set up all the equipment we set up the uh, mixer we set up uh, our audio our mics we run tests beforehand and we typically show up to get everything set up and then we run through it we do our thing we have the play-by-play -play announcer and uh, color commentary in there and we just call the game down and we post uh, onto social media and onto um, we also do a radio live stream as well so it goes live over the radio. I think Ian has really done a fantastic job. A lot of, a lot of time management skills are required for it because you basically end up covering almost every game. You really need to make sure that you're, you're focused and that you're ready for anything and also, you know where you want to go with your life, and you're, you're really locked in on that field. Uh, it's definitely a challenge, yeah, just uh, making sure I uh, put enough time for homework, put enough time for rugby, and then making enough time for broadcasting, and I also work off campus as well, so it's a lot of um, just managing time and doing that properly. Uh, it can be stressful times sometimes, there's no doubt about that. It can definitely be stressful with all the work that I have. And uh, that can be said for any one of the broadcasters because it is a lot because we all have our own lives. We work, we have school work, and then we do prep for games. And so, yeah, it can be a lot, but yes, I definitely do enjoy it. I hope to do play by play, if not by the end of this year for baseball, uh, definitely next year. It's definitely going to be difficult out of college, so that's why I'm doing my best to get another, enough experience here with RSN, athletics, and uh, just playing sports as well helps out. So. Just gaining enough experience and the idea is to get into some sort of broadcasting role, if not possibly sports writing.